local grocery store. It's about almost one o'clock. Found this coffee for babe. Get that for her. See what else we got. No way. Corn oil. Chicken, broccoli, and rice. Bunch of grapes and salads. Toaster strudels. of corn oil. I don't mind if I do. Yeah, yeah look at that. And a pizza. Uh, box of raspberry peach smuckers fruit spread. Hmm. Don't know why I threw this out. Well, it just expired a couple of days ago. February 11th. They're still good. They still got some light in them. Plenty of light in them. in the stuff from yesterday. Let's set this oven down for real quick. Empty this. Not too much anything in here. Garbage. Yeah. Alright. I'm gonna come back a little later. They're still chunking out some stuff. All righty, guys. Let me try to focus it. There you go. We are home. And this is what we got today. And I say we are home. I've been home all day, honestly. Babe got all of this stuff on his own by himself. So let's just get right into it. We have one, two, three, four, five, five boxes of the um, Aunt Jamama uh pancake mix basically and this is the complete kind so all you have to do is add water which is really good to have in your stockpile because you know you don't want to have something in your stockpile where you have to add milk and eggs and all that just add water and you have some pancakes all ready for you so pretty excited about this like i said we have five of them that is cool ow okay we also have some more down there but all these are open and Babe actually went diving before he went to a meeting. So he left them in the bed of the truck because you know it's pretty cool here. But the bed actually had snow in it. So some of these are just kind of wet and clumpy and we'll probably just throw these away. I mean, I may go through and get out the clumps, but well, I don't know. I can't promise that. So anyway, five of these I thought was a really good find. We have a gallon of the Neapolitan ice cream. You guys know this is the vanilla chocolate and strawberry kind. I have not had this in so long. This is definitely giving me throwback vibes. So it's been a long time since I've had that. I remember when I used to get this as a kid, I would eat the vanilla and strawberry. Never did anything with the chocolate. But yeah, pretty happy to get that. Then we have four packs of bacon here. We have a... What is this? Hickory Country Farmland and Fricks. 
This one looks really good. It says it's gourmet too. It's an applewood smoked bacon. Let's see, 20 to 22 slices per pack. Yeah, this looks pretty big here. Then we just have the regular uh, Hickory Country Bacon Farmland Double Smoked. Looks like quite a bit is in here as well, though. And then uh, more Hickory Country Bacon back there. So four packs. That's great to stock up with. All right, next we have some of the Best Choice Hash Browns. This is just a package of hash browns looks like 10 patties in there 10 hash brown patties so this would be good for a quick breakfast or snack or something they actually look like and remind me of the mcdonald's hash browns and i love those things for some reason so i think these are a little bigger but anyway very excited about this okay we have three of the oscar meyer deli meat packages uh, we have a Virginia brand uncured ham. Oh, that's funny. Virginia brand and made in Iowa. <laughs> okay. Uh, Black Forest uncured ham. And Black Forest uncured ham. Interesting thing is all of these expire on the 22nd of March. So we have about a month with that that we can live them in the fridge and then freeze them. But we will probably just go ahead and freeze it now just to be done with it. We have a little room in our fridge because we've been, I mean, in our freezer because we've been giving. Okay, we have the Crutchmar. Um, <laughs> should I pronounce this? Does it embarrass myself? Um, Braunschweiger, Braunschweiger. I don't know. It's this. That's what it is. It almost looks, I read the ingredients. I believe it's pork liver is what it is and it's by the Crutchmar brand and if I'm not mistaken we have some awesome subscribers in Germany that watch us so shout out to all of you all in Germany and shout out to all of you all in the Philippines and basically anywhere outside of the U.S. because I just think it's just so crazy that you even found our channel but I say all that to say that some of our German uh, subscribers were kind of helping me pronounce some of these words <laughs> since this is German. So thank you, thank you, because if you leave it up to this girl to pronounce it, y'all not going to know what I'm talking about. Okay, we also have some lemonade. This is so cool. I never buy stuff like this, like ever buy stuff like this. So I always get very excited when we get this. This is sell by, I don't know if you guys can see it, 11-3 of 21. And this is sell by 9 of 5 of 21, but two lemonades. Very excited about that. I have a pitcher, and I will probably make some lemonade. Now I need to find some dumpster lemons just for garnish. You know what I mean? That just sounds so good. Next, Babe knew I was going to be excited about this, and I am. We have some best choice breakfast roast ground coffee. Listen, anytime you're able to find coffee. When you're diving, at least me, because I drink the heck out of some coffee. So it is, it's, it's great to dive and find anything. But when you find something you actually use, it's like a whole new level. So I am so excited. And it is still actually, um, it's still sealed. And you can fill it like right up to here. So they have that packed good. And it is two pounds, you guys. This is a... Very big container. I mean, my hand fits in the whole thing. So you see how big this is. So I'm very excited about that. Next up, we have some toaster strudel. I can't remember if I showed you. This is probably the second one that we've that we've gotten. I don't think I showed you the first one though. I think we gave it already before I filmed. It was gonna be in one of the small halls because we only found like two things that day. But sometimes with those hauls, we give it so fast or else we use it so fast that I forget to film it. So sometimes you guys don't see all of that. Now the box is open, which is probably why they threw it away. That's fine. It comes with the toaster strudels here, as well as the cream down there. So this looks really good. This is the wild berry flavor. 
I love Pop-Tarts, but I don't think I've tried these. I'm very excited to try these, though, because they look so good, especially since you put your own icing on there. Very happy about that. We have some Noor brand rice sides. This is the chicken flavored broccoli. I love finding stuff like this, too, that you can pop in your pantry and use as a side with a meal. You guys know we find tons of meat, but sides and stuff like that, it's always great to find. So this is cool. Babe found a grape mix tray, just basically a tray of grapes. And he even brought me some kitty chicken, you guys. We have kitty fried chicken, kitty hot wings. Uh, and they are not super hot at all because I tried them and I was like, these aren't hot at all. So I feel okay giving the kitties these. Um, kitty chicken tender, kitty fried chicken, and more fried chicken and stuff. And if you guys are wondering, if you're new to the channel and have no idea what I'm talking about, usually this stuff, I'm a little more strict when it comes to stuff that has been hot and cooled down just because I don't know what temp they've kept it and you guys know I actually work in the um health field not really I work for the state but dealing with monitoring you know some stuff without saying too much anyway so I'm very um particular with that one thing I showed you guys once I'm done a lot of the meats and stuff if they're not frozen I actually temp them so um, but yeah, so this stuff we mainly just give to the kitty. So that's why I call it kitty chicken. So we have all of these and it's so good, especially now because it's been cold. Um, it's good to make them some hot meals. So that's been great. Moving on, we have a ton of peanut butter, which I don't think you've seen yet because it's going to be in a small haul. But we were talking the other day like, man, now we just need some jelly. And look what we found. We got some Smuckers, and this is the Peach Raspberry Fruit Spread. We have Strawberry Mango. I think those are the only flavors. Peach Raspberry. Oh, no. Uh, cherry Blueberry. So we have those three flavors. Let me set them here so you guys can see it. Okay, so these are the flavors right here that we got. It looks like we just got two of each. So I think this will make a really creative innovative peanut butter and jelly sandwich pretty cool and last but not least one of the things I'm probably the most excited about mainly because we actually had to go out and buy some oil who was that babe? Uh, a week ago. yeah maybe about a week ago or so we actually had to go buy cooking oil because we had found a lot of big lots and um yeah we used it so <laughs> Went out and bought it, but now look at here. We have five of the 100% pure corn oil. I had never really cooked with corn oil before, but it said it had a smoke point of about 450 degrees. So you are able to fry with it or do whatever you're going to do with it. And we have five of them. So that is so exciting. So, yep, you guys, we have five of those. And then over here is just more kitty chicken. Okay, so this was today's daytime haul. Quite a bit of stuff. I think this is a great haul. Got lots of breakfast stuff with the bacon, the hash browns. I mean, we even got some coffee, some jam. I guess we don't have enough bread to put it on now. Well, we have pancakes too. This is a breakfast haul. How about that? Let's just name this a breakfast haul. But Super excited. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you have, definitely give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel and we will just see you in the next video. Bye guys.